I'm Dick Brennan in for Maurice Dubois. And I'm Christine Johnson. We begin today with that new video tonight of a driver plowing into people standing on a sidewalk in Midtown. It happened late last night. More than half a dozen people now recovering. Police sources say the victims are both local residents and visitors from Maryland, Italy, and China. CBS 2's Alice Skeener is live in Midtown with more. Alice. Well, right now, police say they don't believe the 29 year old female driver was intoxicated. Charges are pending. The NYPD says she is currently receiving treatment at a local hospital. This is the moment police say a driver veers off the road and onto the sidewalk, knocking down seven people, sending bodies flying into the air. We're stopping the video before impact and picking it up as she drives off just as quickly as she struck. It happened at 36th and 6th Avenue just before midnight. This fast food employee witnessed it. I'm here inside and I go, I use the phone and I go outside and a car coming to very fast and push it. People mangled. There's, I, yeah, I was, lots of blood. This filmmaker describes the aftermath. I came into the scene, there was people strung out. I thought there was a shooting. Uh, one of the people on our team was a medic, thank God, and he was one of the first people there. Just did triage till the medics got there. Police say the 29 year old female driver continued to the Queens Midtown Tunnel, where, upon exiting, she crashed into a car. They say no one was injured. It happened near the LIE and the Clearview Expressway. She was arrested and taken to a hospital for a psych evaluation. Police say that six men and one woman were injured. They range in age from 24 to 60 years old with various head, arm, and leg injuries. The most serious, a 34 year old woman listed in critical but stable condition. Again, charges are pending. The investigation is ongoing. Live in Midtown, Alice Gaynor, CBS 2 News. All right, Alice, thank you.